Bulb users, um, this is Jessica and I'm here with Bill who is a former college professor and now works with us um, at Bulb Digital Portfolios and we wanted to ask him some questions about getting students ready for college and what's expected of them and what's the hope and um, the desire. So um, we're going to jump in. Bill, how are you? I'm great. Good. <laughs> Good to be with you. Um, as a college professor, what are some of the things you'd like to see students have when they enter the college classroom? Well, I think uh, what I like to see in, in students is, is a lot of initiative. I like to see them ready to learn, wanting to learn. And I think um, it's really, it's, it's great to be able to see a student um, who responds to um, the classroom, the, the topics that we're going to be discussing. One of the things, for example, that I do um, at the beginning of every class when I teach is uh, I get a survey done by the students. And they tell me what they um, like, what they want to um, learn about in the class, and that gives me a good sense of what to kind of focus on and and um, you know emphasize as we go through the course. Yeah, that's really cool. How would you recommend students utilize Bulb in the college setting with all of those? Things? So it's a great way, I think, to interact with the, the teachers. They can yeah. be putting things in their portfolio that they share with their teacher about themselves. Um, I think it's a great way for them to just track through their learning. Yeah. So in a course, um, if it's a course where they're doing a lot of research, they can have their research journal in bold and they can you know, keep track of their sources. Mm -hmm. They can keep track of their all their notes from that research, capturing data or quotations, of course, all of the citations, oh, you know, yeah. all that kind of information. And it all stays in one place. But the great thing about bold is they can be doing work in various applications, yeah. whether it's a spreadsheet um, collecting data or whether it's mm -hmm. a word processor or anything else, and they just keep, you know, keep it all in one place in Bulb. You can pile it all there. It's great. So. Yeah, that's, I love that. I think as a, I graduated college a couple of years ago and there's no place for all my work or my thought process or how I kind of worked through the details as we were always using these various applications and then trying to figure out how to co-collaborate. Um, how would you advise a high school educator to help students use Bolt for college readiness now? That's great. Yeah, I, I think um, the high school at the high school level, they're they're learning certain basic skill sets, mm -hmm. right? And so Bolt is a great way to show those skill sets they're learning. They're learning how um, to identify sources of information. Um, where to go to get certain kinds of information, how to um, understand whether those sources of information are valid or not, or, or authoritative, and how to interact with those sources. Um, but other skill sets, you know, writing, the skills of writing, which was a big part for me in the courses I taught. So demonstrating and, and for them, themselves even, to see their progress in writing. It's really encouraging. So I, I encourage, I would encourage students to look back at their their portfolios mm -hmm. and remember mm -hmm. kind of where they've come from and, and you know, yeah. be encouraged by that and continue to progress. Mm, that's really cool. Well, do you have any final thoughts on or tips of the trade for college students who are about to, or high school seniors who are about to jump into college? Yeah, I think um, one thing uh, that's really important is, is uh, capturing learning across every area of life. Yes. Right? So, um, I used to teach a, a course with NYU that was um, had a lot of group projects, and so one thing that I noticed with them was that they needed to work together in teams. They needed to identify a goal and objective. They yeah. needed to be able to align all their tasks towards that goal and objective, and those are the same kinds of things that you can learn in, in theater, athletics, or whatever whatever it is that you're doing. So I think for them to be thinking about how they can learn from every experience they have mm -hmm. and documenting that and as they document it and reflect on it, it sort of sinks in better. And so um, if they want to be developing as a whole person, Bulb's a great place to, to document that yeah. and capture all that learning. Yeah, and as we spoke this past week on the area of reflection and giving students the opportunity to really kind of hone in on what they learned from every experience is really awesome. So. Thank you so much, Bill. Yep, it was awesome Jess. to have you. Bye, everyone.